friends and uh, welcome to Shitpost Thursdays. If you did not expect this to be a shitpost, well now you're warned. For those of you who are prepared though, I got a suggestion to go through my corset collection. I am not an avid corset collector. I know very little about it, but I have some. Some are, yeah, guilty. I keep them in this bag because uh, once again, if you expected quality from this, <laughs> you are mistaken. This one I think I got off of Amazon during the waist trainer craze. Um, if you uh, think that there is a difference between a corset and a waist trainer, you are mistaken. Uh. The bra clip things. To me, I mean, that's like one of the hardest parts is just so many freaking bra clips. I think this is my first one, just kind of to figure out how it was. It's got um, plastic boning in it and it's just, a really cheapy Amazon one. And I think that I got this one specifically because it seemed easier because it zips up as well. It only has one, two, three, four little clips um, and then a zipper, so. And there, we do have like a lot of back support. I don't see like bunching out of the shoulders. So that's pretty typical. I have worn it to class before and I will warn you, if you try to just like, this is class, this is three hours long, I want to slouch halfway through the le the lecture. You know how it looks when you pop open um, like a can of biscuits? That's how you feel if you try to slouch in a corset. Pretty comfortable. It does help with posture, but if you're curious what being in a corset kind of feels like, and you find one of these for sale, they might be cheaper now that the waist trainer craze is out the window. This one I feel is um, pretty accurate, but yeah. I've been told that some of them are accurate, some of them are not. Release, release me, got more to do. This one, it is a Fashion Nova corset and it has these freaking bra hooks that I hate, but this one is an overbust corset. I'm only gonna do like a couple of these hooks though because these hooks are only like an inch apart, but this is just a cheapy for show kind of costumey corset. I just got it for a Princess Aurora cosplay because I thought that I could do something with these little flower details. And this is probably one of the most flexible boned corsets. Well, we did the Aurora corset, so might as well do the Ariel one next. I don't know what this brand is, but it's another secondhand thing. Once again, it's a fashion thing, so very, very weak boning. Do, 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 do. Looks like that, and I do have to wear a bra to be Princess Ariel, but I refuse to do that right now because I don't have to wear a bra, therefore I will not wear a bra because boobs are awful, and I do not recommend having them ever. Oh, there, do you need to help? You want to say hello? I have a camera. Are you a movie star? No, you're my Prince Charming, yes. Oh, you want down now. I have had enough of your foolishness, mother. No. So yeah, my two black corsets are also my two shitty corsets. I know I can self-place this one. It's getting the mental, mental clarity too. So, busk is right here. Hookies are in the front, and you do have to go in order. I don't think it really matters if you go bottom first or top first, but they hook like that. See the lacing, you just pull it. I think I could go tighter. Yeah, I just want a little bit tighter. Um, I think that I need to, I don't know, can the bottom go tighter? This one I might need to relace. I made it slightly too tight up here, but slightly too loose down here. I want a little bit more support. This is still um, the plastic boning, but this is a good plastic boning. To tie it, you can just tie it in front and that's all. Uh, pretty good structure, pretty good support, but it is the plastic boning, so I still do have, you know, some little flexibility. I can still dance and whatever. <laughs> Very autism friendly for the autists who feel like they need to be hugged constantly. I have two special corsets though that I got at Gen Con. So I will say that they are from Timeless Trends. And I will try to link the website for Timeless Trends down below. Uh, please open it in a new tab though, because that's what YouTube prefers. These corsets are steel boned. What is more similar to the traditional corsetry whale boning? 
is definitely like the plastic cords. Um, they do actually make a synthetic whalebone as well. All of the Timeless Trends corsets are steel boned. So if you are new to corsetry, I wouldn't necessarily say start with the steel boned ones. I did because I'm an idiot. That's a running theme on this channel. This one they put in the bag for me, they laced it all tied up, all tight again. And it is supposed to have a gap in the back. Usually uh, corsets will have like a modesty panel that will come with it. These didn't. Oh yeah, it would also help to uh, do that part. Welcome to Shit Post Thursdays. It's a cluster. So, like each of the hooks has to catch on a little button, but the buttons don't necessarily want to be caught. Oh wait, wait. Always wear a slip, but the slip sometimes does get in the way. So I have all the little grommets in. A lot of room back there. I feel like I need a little bit more support here. This is a steel bond one. Um, also, as you can see, there is a lot of room right here. So just like I'm gonna try size that down with a tug. That would be it. And just so you can see, <sighs> big breaths. I'm not squished. It's steel boned, so it's not nearly as flexible, but it is a lot more supportive. I feel like the way that I am lacing, just because I have no idea what I'm doing, um, I'm choosing between being secure up top or secure at the butular region. Once again, a gap, because there's supposed to be a gap. If I had somebody helping me, I would probably do the overarm method and have them lace it so that they could get it a little bit tighter, a little bit more secure, and actually lace more evenly so I don't have weird gaps on my butt. Do, 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 do. I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like those. Let's see how good my brain is today. I think that is upside down. Hmm. Okay, that worked. <sighs> We're not looking in the mirror. Okay, okay, we have we have determined that that is a rule for this. This is my only for obvious reasons hourglass corset. Just shimming it down to my natural waistline, which is a little bit uh, lower than most people's. And this is very much the corset that I would hold my hands over my head while somebody else tied. Would also be very helpful because there are a lot of um, loose little ribbon bits. Let's uh, let's tie it off here and let you get a closer look because I'm 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 not looking in the mirror. Not nope 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 not gonna happen. I did bring the camera a little bit closer so you can actually see a little bit more accurately. Trying really hard not to look in the viewfinder, failing miserably. But yeah, this is an hourglass corset. Yeah, it's it 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 can get tighter. It's not placed all the way. It, it can get tighter. I know that uh, it can get tighter. There's so many of these little dangly bits up there and down there and uh. I, I would also like uh, to reiterate that I am not taking deep breaths because I can't breathe. The fact that I am taking deep breaths means that I can breathe and this is actually loose in the topular region because the way that I failed at lacing it, I just, uh, I feel like I very much look like a girl. And I'm very dysphoric right now. Gender dysphoria induced panic attack sounds like a pretty good way to uh, stop this video, so. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to list them down below. Oh god, someone save me. New videos come out on Mondays, sometimes Thursdays, and as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye! <laughs> I, I'm, I'm fine, I'm just gonna put on a binder after this, and like a big hoodie, and we're gonna be good. <laughs>